Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a review and overview of my new diaper bag from Skip Hop. You guys saw my, those who follow me, saw my video here on YouTube that I did a what's in my toddler bag, in my diaper bag for my toddler for the theme park, like I packed it for the theme park. And um, you guys comment, you know, you guys did some comments that if that you guys wanted to get the bag but you guys saw some reviews on the internet that it said that the bag wouldn't last long because of the where the stroller clips are sewn in so i wanted to do my bag right now is empty and before i start packing it for tomorrow's outing i just wanted to do a review like an overview of the bag and show you guys the bag how it is right now um, if you saw my video, you saw that I really, really, really packed it like a lot. I had a lot of stuff. And the day that we went to like to Disney, I kept putting some more stuff in here. I would put her sweater. I would put things that we would buy. So the bag kept getting like stuffed and stuffed and stuffed. Myself, um, you guys made me concerned also because I really didn't, when I got the bag, I really didn't look at the stroller clips. Um, and I did was using my bag and I was just in, I didn't really pay attention where the how the stroller clips were sewn onto the bag you guys made me concerned but um, my bag is still good and I been using it you know since then I don't use it every day because I do use her little zoo backpack most of the time just so so far I've been using it quite not as much as if I had a newborn or a baby like a smaller baby um, but I am using it a lot so let me read to you guys an overview um, of the bag. So this bag that I have here, it's the Skip Hop Forma Pack and Go Diaper Tote. So this is the Forma Pack and Go Diaper Tote from Skip Hop. So what it says here, the overview that we, that I'm, I'm looking it up on my phone it says we listen to the parents to create the most functional and fashionable baby bag yet the highly designed bag comes loaded with two packing cubes and 11 pockets to keep everything in place along with a cushioned changing pad featuring lightweight fabric and quilted details the water resistant bag is perfect for anywhere the day might take you and convenient front zip pocket holds one matching mesh packing cube and one trendy pattern insulated cube which is perfect for bottles sippy cups or snacks the forma is the forma is the ultimate pack and go organization for infancy to toddlerhood and beyond so um what the reason why i got this bag is because it said toddlerhood so I do have a toddler and it kind of drew me to it as well. And, you know, I was kind of excited because the price was good and it came with two accessories with two, you know, a matching cube, a mesh, a mesh cube and a little insulator, which I thought it was so cool that it came with little accessories just because I can pack each little cube and I can just pull out those you know those two accessories those two cubes and put them in my bag if I am using my purse at that time and I can just leave the rest of the stuff in the car and just carry something lightweight like I can pack like one of the bags just for it to be ready to go in my purse does that explain you guys okay so let's go into the bag so this is the bag this is in the peacock color is this beautiful teal color and what I love about it the most is like how big it is and it's perfect. It is lightweight. The fabric is a nylon material. Um, in the inside, it's also like that nylon material. So it says it is a water resistant bag. Yes, it does. It is a water resistant bag. Um, the only thing that is hard to keep it clean, guys. It is the most hard, especially with a toddler that has sticky fingers. It is hard to keep it clean. I regret getting this color. I would totally go more for the black color. I fell in love with this color just because 
it is a beautiful teal color and it was something different than usually what I would get which was a black diaper bag but I wish I did get it in black just because um, it is getting dirt it, you know if you have it on and you you know scrape it or like scuff it on something that will transfer to the bag um, that's just a little downside of it um, but it is pretty easy to clean you just get like a little sponge you wipe it and you let it dry and it's, it'll be clean again so it's not that big of a deal because you could clean it so it has a pocket here and this is the mommy pocket this pocket is pretty big it has a faux little leather tab here zipper tab and it, it's like this and it has a little cell phone pocket here then we have two zippers right here and um, they also are faux leather and you unzip it and we have our two you open it like this and we have our two accessories which are the cubes so one of the cubes is a insulated bag which is pretty awesome because I can you know now that it's getting warmer I can put a little ice pack in here and put like her water some waters or some yogurts things and I just love to put her snacks in here not only do I put her snacks and when we go to church I usually take the bag plus I take my own purse so what I do is that I put her um, hands and face wipes her passy wipes because she always has a pacifier with her um, her passy wipes and her some snacks in here and I just throw this in my bag and that is only thing I need for church and the rest of the diaper stuff because if I need to change a diaper I even I have to go outside anyways so this just is what's in my purse so I really really love this little bag I love the fact that it came with a bag either way I still had her matching little zoo lunch bag lunchable bag bag but this is way thinner and more smaller and petite for like a purse so it is perfect and then or if you don't want to put it in your purse you can just carry it it does have a handle so it's very cool that it has a handle it's, it's very accessible very convenient love love this then it comes with the matching mesh cube Which it had I always put a diaper a changing pad um, in here just one diaper though and just things that I would I feel like I would need if I run quickly to a store let's say I go to Target and I'm gonna do this quick run and I do not want to carry her diaper bag because usually what I do on the everyday basis is that I just leave my diaper bag in the car um, just because I don't feel like I want to carry her diaper bag unless I'm gonna be out all day like let's say we go to the mall I do use the diaper bag or let's say we go you know theme parks I need the diaper bag to be there with me so I just pack the bag for me and the and my toddler and you know my kids um, the day we went to the theme park I just had strictly had this bag packed just for my kids I took a little crossbody bag for me with my personal stuff my phone my wallet my personal stuff because I wasn't I was planning you know when you park the stroller leave the stroller with the diaper bag I wasn't gonna take it off um, so what I do is just I pack things that I would need just in case so then if I do go like to Target and I need to just get off quickly and just go walk around for a little bit of time I don't carry the whole diaper bag I just throw this in my purse so yeah this is very convenient I really really like this bag so when you open the little the pocket there is two mesh pockets right here uh, the only downside is that you can't use the cubes if you have um, you can't use the these pockets you can't use them or put anything in there unless it's really thin and flat because if you're using the cubes it won't give you any room for anything else that's the only downside of this so um, it's either the cubes or you use the mesh pockets now the straps on this they're very lightweight I really like them they're not like thick or heavy it has this little faux leather so the bag would not won't slip so I really like that about that. Um, it has this large zipper panel. You can open it up and if you, you can either have it zipped or you can just bring down the two panels and have it open as a tote. It only has two pockets, 
which it's a really downside for a diaper bag for it only to have two pockets in the main big compartment. I'm used to diaper bags that have like pockets on the side, pockets on, you know, like four, more than two pockets. Um, but other than that, that's the only thing. Now here's what you guys were concerned about, the stroller clips. The stroller clips are right here and it's made out of this material and you can adjust them here and then they have the little clip. Um, you guys were right, they are sewn to this gray material here. The gray material feels like a nylon material, it's not super thin like that it's going to start tearing. Um, it is really dur it feels really durable, the material feels really durable. Um, the day that I took it to the theme park, it was super super packed. Um, I've used it like about, how many times did I use it really really packed? I've used it like four to three times, you know, three to four times really really packed because I do, like I said, when I go out on the weekends with my husband and family outings, I pack, pack this bag because I do not want to be without anything and I put it on the stroller. I don't see any signs of the fabric stretching um, but if I feel, this is what I feel and my my honest opinion about it. I feel that you know I have a toddler so I don't carry as much as I would carry if I would go to the theme park. That is not my everyday packing that is not, not even when I go to the, not even on the weekends when I have family outings, not even like that. I never, I don't have it so, so packed like how I showed you guys in that video. That I would only, I would only pack it so much if I would go to a theme park or to a zoo or somewhere where it be an, like an attractions and amusement park, something like that. I would pack every single thing because obviously I'm not going to have that accessibility to go to the car. Um, so my honest opinion is if you have a newborn and you are a heavy packer, this bag and it, you know, and if you go out and about and you're using it, using the stroller clips like a lot, like using them like 24 seven, you know, putting these babies, these stroller clips to work, I feel that if you're a heavy packer, this will tear in the long run. It will start tearing. I feel like the stitching will start getting undone with time, okay? In my case, I have a toddler, okay? I do not pack so much stuff anymore. Like I don't pack formula, I don't pack certain things, right? I still feel like I am a heavy pack packer, but not as much, I kinda tone it down. Um, if you are a lightweight packer and you know how to pack lightweight, then this bag will be perfect for you. And the stroller clips, if you, and you use the stroller clips, it will last you a little bit longer. Um, I can't guarantee you I only had the bag for a month, so I can't guarantee you that it won't even happen to me. So yeah, that is a concern also for me if I would have read the review that like the reviews you guys read, I would have totally backed off and not got in the bag. That is my honest opinion. Um, I feel like the the clip, like where they sewed the stroller clips, I feel like they should have also sewn it to the other to the other fabric. You guys, um, that is my honest opinion. So that is the only downside. But other than that, the bag is beautiful. I love the fact that it comes with accessories. For the price, for $70, it is a perfect bag for, you know, it's a perfect bag for me because it comes with accessories. And if you're those moms that don't always, I mean, I don't always carry the diaper bag with me. I sometimes just leave it in the car. I, I either just pack one of these little mesh pockets, throw it in my purse, and I'm good to be on with my day. My toddler is already two and a half, so she doesn't really need me to carry this, this bag. Unless I'm going to be out and about with my husband and I can clip it on the stroller. I, you know, that is just that. But my bag lately has not been super, super packed like how I had it packed for that theme park day. So in the back we have this pocket here. It is a pretty big pocket and that's where the changing mat goes. My daughter is too big for that changing mat so I don't use it. 
Um, so that is that is the pocket right here. The only downside to it is that you can't really use this pocket if the inside is really, really packed. Um, you could only use it, like let's say you go to the doctor, you can just put papers for the doctors or the mail in here. Nothing super thick, nothing, you can't really use that pocket. But that is my overview and my honest opinion. On so that was my honest opinion and my honest review on the Forma Pack and Go diaper bag from Skip Hop. Hopefully it was helpful and love you all. Please subscribe. Bye guys.